Well, mostly I get like, are you crazy? And uh, some look excited. They, they're like, wow, that's interesting. And some like, mostly negative. <laughs> Facing a spider can be a hair-raising experience for many. But this piano teacher in Hong Kong finds these hairy creatures so adorable, she lives with hundreds of them at her home. When I was really small, my mom brought me to a tree planting activity. And I saw a spider clawing on the floor, and then I picked it up. And I found it quite cute. Um, the first tarantula I got was a uh, rose hair. Of course it died because I didn't know how to take care of it. The, the internet wasn't so developed, I couldn't find information about tarantula so easily. That is Herman's living room. Those towers of plastic boxes stacked along the walls, they all have spiders in them. But not just any spider. Most of her pets are tarantulas, an exotic, hairy species of spiders whose bite isn't serious or deadly. At most, it can get your skin itchy. I put the tarantulas in my room first, but I had more and more after a few years, and then I started, I had to put them in the living room. There is one particular thing I like about tarantula because I also love stuffed toys and they are hairy and they look fluffy. Yeah, I think that's why I like tarantula a lot more than other species of spiders. Um, they eat crickets. Crickets is the best food for them. How much do they eat? It depends on the size of the tarantula. As long as the, the abdomen is not more than twice the size of the head, then that's fine, you can keep feeding the tarantula. Yeah. Well, I, I just try to remember which section I have fed, but I usually just don't remember. <laughs> Um, you don't play. You don't play with tarantulas. You just um, keep them and look at them, look at their colors, look at their shape, and like looking at your fish pet. You don't interact with fishes, right? And they don't really have an emotional reaction. Lately, Herman has found a new love, reptiles. Lizards and iguanas now share her living room with the spiders. Thankfully, they make for more playable pets, as it's easy to handle them. Well, I always liked reptiles, but I, I didn't have the urge to buy any of the reptiles. I just like them. I just look at them and, oh, they're cute and stuff. Herman has nearly 300 spiders of different kinds. She has also built an online community of about 4,000 tarantula collectors in Hong Kong through a Facebook page yes. she manages. They organize meetups to display their favorite pets and share their common love. In the circle, she is lovingly called Spider Mum. Well, I have a pair of students and they are like brother sisters. And then, of course, the sisters having, when the sister was having lesson, the brother was sitting here looking at the tarantulas. And he kept saying, oh, it's disgusting, like for the whole lesson. <laughs> yeah. 